This is Yobachi2007 on YouTube, and I'm reviewing the Casey Anthony hearing that took place today. Y'all know the uh, story. If not, here's a quick recap. I think uh, back in the early summer, uh, Casey Anthony, who's uh, approximately 23 years old, her three-year-old daughter went missing, uh, was missing for a month. The grandmother of the, of the three-year-old, the mother of the 23-year-old, uh, after not hearing from the granddaughter, not being able to speak to her for a month, finally cornered her daughter and asked her what happened to her. The daughter couldn't give a good explanation, said she was kidnapped by a uh, by a babysitter. So the grandmother, Cindy Anthony, called 911. Okay, so fast forward, and after sitting in jail for most of the last half year, uh, Kaylee Anthony's body was found in December by a phone line repairman, I believe. And today was today they had a hearing for Casey Anthony, who's being charged with the murder. So Casey Anthony is all dressed up for this hearing, which is unusual instead of being in the normal prison garb. And uh, she's even got her hair pulled back in a bun. So they first bring her in and she's wearing handcuffs shackled to her waist. And then she sits down for a second and then they lead her out of the courtroom. And she emerges back into the courtroom a few minutes later with no handcuffs and shackles. Uh, obviously her lawyers want to present her in a particular way but uh, they had the feed coming out of the courtroom even before the hearing started so we actually got to see her in the handcuffs and shackles still even though she wasn't wearing them for the official start of the hearing alright so there was a couple of things that uh, were a number of things that came up today but there were a couple of particular things that uh, came out of today's hearing one the judge granted defense's motion to be allowed to search the field where Kaylee Anthony's body was found the uh, owner of that property did not show up to uh, contest or to speak about being able to, uh, about having his property searched. But since uh, he didn't show up, the judge just granted the defense the right for their scientists and for them to their investigators to search that field for their uh, own evidentiary purposes. The second main thing was the motion by the defense to have prosecution counsel thrown off the case was denied by the judge apparently this the the prosecutor's office had sent in a complaint to the bar association about the defense lawyer he felt that they were trying to disrupt miss anthony's right to legal counsel through that but that motion was denied those were the two big happenings that came out of the case today and uh, we'll see what happens next i'm not sure when the next hearing is is scheduled for but you can go to blackperspective.net where i have video of today's hearings including that feed video from before the hearing started which is uh, kind of interesting again that's www.blackperspective.net peace